hope you're well. Today I'm going to be showing you a video on a few items that I've been collecting over this past month. And let me know down in the comments below if you guys like these types of videos and what other videos you guys would like to see next. But yeah, we'll get on cracking to the first few items. I'll see you guys later. So the first few items that I have been collecting are from Lennon Drugs because they had a huge sale. Uh, for those who don't know Lennon Drugs, it's kind of like a Target. Here are the few items that I have purchased from Lennon Drugs. The first one is the Real Technique Sponge. So it's pretty much like the Sephora's Beauty Blender, but it's a way cheaper alternative. And they finally have these in um, the London Drugs in my area. And I was so, so excited to try this. The next item that I bought from London Drugs was the Maybelline Great Lashes Mascara. And I do have the clear version of this, but I did see in another video, I forgot who was using it. I'm pretty sure it was Emily Noel, but anyhow. Somebody was using the Great Lash Mascara, and I like that it has the little applicator and the little brush so I just could get underneath um, your bottom lashes, and especially mine, because I, mine are so itty bitty and little, and they need a lot of help. So hopefully this Great Lash Mascara works. I got it in very black, and I'll let you guys know how this works. It says it's supposed to have lots of volume, no clumps, and no mess. So. I'll let you guys know. Maybe I'll do a first impression on this. But, yeah, this was the other item that I got. And the third item I got was the Maybelline's Age Rewind. You guys know this is one of my favorite concealers, if not my most favorite concealer, as of recently. And this is probably my fourth purchase of this. And I got this in the shade Medium because I am now darker than the medium before I was way too light for this. Um, so yeah, obviously I've been tanning from work as you guys can see, or hopefully you guys can see, and I'm excited to try this again. Second last product I got was this NYX's matte bronzer. I don't know, I was just so excited to see all the NYX stuff was on sale at Lennon Drugs, I guess for some reason on the day that I went. It was just a huge, huge sale, so I just Ended up buying so much, even though I just, um, was deciding to buy one thing. But anyhow, this NYX bronzer, I got this, and it's the matte bronzer, shade Deep Tan. And I'll show you guys right here. It's a really, really nice matte bronzer. I'll swatch it for you guys. And you guys can't really see it. Sorry, there's another swatch there, which I'll show you guys later. But yeah, there's that one. And I, I'm actually wearing it today. I'm wearing it as my contour and also my all-over face bronzer. And I've been really liking it. It's not muddy at all. And it just is perfect for my skin tone right now because I am a bit more tan. And the very last item that I got was a Maybelline... Oh, no, sorry. Not a Maybelline color tattoo. L'Oreal <laughs> Infallible um, Cream Eyeshadow. And this one is in Tender Caramel. And it was about $5.49 as you guys can see on sale from $10.99 and yes like I said this is tender caramel and you guys know I love amber rush so when I saw this um, I was pretty excited and when I swatched it it was I was just oh it was great so let me just swatch this right here no right here really nice color um, it's more like a taupey color. I don't know if you guys can see from here. Yeah, overall it's a really nice taupey color. I really like it and it's just in general, I love these L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadows. They just glide on so smoothly and they're great bases for any other eyeshadows that you guys decide to put on top. And next to my haul, I got one thing from Sephora this past weekend, and it's a NARS blush, and I'm so excited because it's my very first NARS blush ever, and I gotta say, I can see what all the hype's about from this NARS brand, and this is the blush in Taos, Taos, T-A-O-S, and let me just show you here in the pan, and it comes in this really small pan right here, and let me just show you guys what it looks like in the pan and here it is it's just a really really beautiful deep rosy color I actually have it on my cheeks today and I I was using this Real Techniques multi task brush and I put I think too much of it on and when I put it on my cheeks I was like 
whoa, that's way too much. So I had to actually go in with my Real Techniques buffing brush and just buff that into my skin. And it's blended so perfectly. And I really love the finish of it. It has light specks of glitter in it. But for the most part, it's pretty bronze. And this is actually the color I had swatched. As you guys can see, there's, there it is. It shows up really, really well. It's super pigmented and it's just beautiful. So yeah, there's that blush. And that was the only thing that I got from Sephora. I held myself back because I knew, no, nah, I don't need that many things. But I just had to get this NARS blush when I saw it. And now on to clothes. And so in this big Forever 21 bag, um, this past week my boyfriend and I went shopping just because we kind of needed a de-stressor and we hadn't been shopping in a long while. And so within this Forever 21 bag, there are two other bags in here. But don't worry, I didn't get too, too much. <laughs> At least not all for me anyway. And so the first stop when we went to the mall was from Urban Behavior. Well, I guess it's a store here in, in Canada. And from Urban Behavior, they, um, the Urban Behavior at my location, they were having a huge sale because they're going under renovation right now. And I got two things. I got this floral shirt. And it's kind of like a crop top. And it's really cute and summery and I'm so excited to wear it. I'm going to wear it this Sunday to my choir party's picnic and it's Hawaiian theme so I'm so excited for that. But there's this one and it's really really cute. And the back is just a button up and it's just really dainty and summery so I'm excited to get to be wearing that. And also I got this kimono and it's just really sheer. It was only 10 bucks and it was on sale. But it's just nice and light and airy. It's pretty see-through, but I, I would say that it's really nice for summer or even just to layer up during the spring when it gets warmer. And it's just really flowy and I really, really like it. So th those are the two things I got from Urban Behavior. So from H&M, this, this is actually one item that I got. See guys, I did really well for myself. So from H&M, it was also on sale. I don't know, that day that my boyfriend and I went, everything was on sale. I don't know if they're trying to clear out all their summer stuff, but it was just crazy insane. And I got these pants, kind of like harem pants, not really. i just been needing some bottoms and I've been slowly collecting them. But they're just really comfy and it's something I can wear to work or even on a casual night out or a casual day out. And it was only, I think... 10 bucks um, discounted from 20 bucks so that was really great so i'm excited to wear that because i just for me i'm all about comfort i'm not too into fashion but i just want to be comfortable so there was that one thing that i got from h&m and lastly from forever 21 yeah it's all about the florals all the floral things have been on sale it's crazy insane from forever 21 i got this floral skirt it's just really cute it's a little mini skirt that i can wear um to the beach or in a girl's night out or maybe a little date night but i thought it was really cute it was only 10 bucks so there's that one and i got one more thing which actually wasn't for me but i'll probably end up using it too my mom was asking me to buy a floral top and I just couldn't find any that would suit her. I got this dress right here. So it's just a really beautiful floral dress. It can be like for a night out or for like a business meeting. I can probably wear this at church or for any other meetings. It's so beautiful and I love the print. It's, it's something unique and this isn't something I have been seeing from ever because usually floral prints are kind of like this or very dainty but this is more mature more demure and i really really like it and it's the fabric is just pretty nice so i can just wear a slip under this and my mom you know my mom was just like oh my god i, I don't know if i can wear it but i kind of want my mom to explore her options a bit in her wardrobe so it's really nice so there was that so those are all the things that i got this past month recently and 
um, I just realized I bought way too much stuff so enough shopping for me but hopefully you guys like these types of videos and this haul this is my second haul now up on my channel but let me know what products you guys like seeing or what you guys have been buying and I'd love to see your videos too so leave them down in the comments below and I'll be sure to check them out but again thank you so much for supporting me by watching and if you guys like these types of videos remember to like favorite and subscribe to see more videos from me but i'll see you guys very soon bye guys